building an environment where your employees can depend on what you say you'll do, whether that means reward or terminate, because it results in an environment of trust and respect. And when you have a culture of transparency, consistency, respect, you create a culture of gratitude and not despair. And just think how that culture translates to not only your home life and that you feel so much better about your business, but also your employee's home life. Because you've created a culture that builds an employee up, they'll leave work truly feeling like they matter and their work matters. So just imagine that employee will now go home to their kids and maybe they'll have a little bit more patience helping them with their homework assignment or make the time to listen to their kids talk about their day. And that has such a ripple effect. So you're not just influencing how you feel and, and your family, but you're influencing other families. And I, I know it's kind of a Pollyanna way to look at it. Um, but I know that your company culture not only affects you, but it has an effect on your employees and a ripple effect on both of your families. So I urge you to start building that culture where things are more transparent, that you let people know how to stay out of trouble and they don't have to guess if they're getting a bonus. You build a culture that's consistent. So you do what you say you're going to do, even when it's hard. And you give them the data that they're craving. And when you do all of that, then you have to make sure that you not only celebrate with, you know, maybe goal celebrations, um, parties, whatever, but the heart and soul of it is really that affirmation and the pats on the back and letting the employees know you did it. I am proud of you and, you know, feel so good about yourself. And we don't say it in those words, but it's the constant affirmation that we give them. And so we don't harp on the bad things. We really drive our culture around the affirmations. And we have a whole system of how we make sure that's in their face, you know, um, that if they're not earning those rewards and affirmations, then they see others getting that, so they want it. And if you reinforce the behavior that you want and need with those attaboys and the celebrations, then you're gonna get more of that, I can promise you. And just remember, it is simple, but it is not easy at all. It's going to be so hard and you're going to want to quit. You really will. It's, you know, again, it's like a diet. You know, it's not, it's not something that you can turn on and off. And when I say a diet, uh, it's a, your culture turnaround is just like your 
turnaround and your eating habits. You can, you know, it's a similar kind of process. It is a day in, day out, you know, toe the line, stick with it kind of um, situation. But you have to plow through it in the tough times as well as the easy times. And if you can do it, I promise you that you and your staff will be so glad you did. <laughs>